Hey guys, welcome back. So, we'll do a first impression of uh, Joy Saike de Lika. Right? Okay, so before we start, let's look at the uh, front yeah. See what it uh, says. A few weeks back, I got. Um, Psyche de Lique. So I, 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 I got Incident Diplomatique and uh, I'm in love with it. I've ordered a full bottle. It, it's such a beautiful fragrance. I've never uh, tried another fragrance that smells like it. It's so beautiful, boozy. Mm, fresh it's a unique combo I've never tried a boozy fresh vetiver patchouli fragrance before I I, I understand that that uh, patchouli can be sometimes like that you know chocolatey uh, you know that type but I guess I've never tried a patchouli prominent uh, fragrance before and I fell in love with it and I was watching uh, the perfume guy videos, uh, you know, smelling uh, great fragrance reviews, right? And then him and Dahlia, they ranked this as uh, number one Joy fragrance. So I got curious and I thought I should try this. So this one is very ambery patchouli and it was released in 2011. Oh. I just did an unboxing of Pardon that was released in 2011 as well. That's a nice coincidence. So this one is, has citrus at the top, patchouli amber, French lab denim, geranium and rose in the middle, vanilla and musk at the base. Okay. Now, I, I think this is a patchouli prominent fragrance, patchouli dominant fragrance. Uh, but let's see how this smells like. So this is a 2ml bottle, I got it from Mr. Perfume Musta at, um, from Melbourne. What if? Mm. It reminds me of something. Oh, this reminds me of something. Is definitely a patchouli dominant fragrance. It smells a little bit like camphor. I think that's probably the patchouli. Yeah, it, it's uh, camphorous. Like the opening is a bit strong and uh, in your face. I'm not liking it. The same thing happened with the uh, incident diplomatic as well, but that didn't have this kind of camphorous uh, fee, um, um, uh, smell about it. Okay, not what I expected. Hmm. So, what do people say for this? So some. So did this? Yeah, I don't know what. Uh, I'm not seeing any. Um, what do you call that? It reminds me of in section. I, I don't see any fragrance that I already know. Uh, so it looks like this is a bit 
unique uh, smelling fragrance. Mm. Yeah, it, it, it smells like camphor basically. Like not, not. Mm, but it also has some, some dark uh, chocolatey kind of element, uh, like uh, aspect uh, to it. So I, I think I'm, what I'm smelling is probably patchouli because I'm, I'm not familiar with how patchouli smells like. But based on whatever I've heard YouTubers talk, right? I have a feeling this could be patchouli. I'm mm, not, not, not a fan of this smell. And they, they, I, I remember reading something like this, 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 this like a typical hippie type of patchouli. And I don't know how hippies used to smell like. And uh... yeah, I, I I'm not a fan as of now at least. Like maybe I'll I'll give it some more time and see how it develops. Um, uh, thanks a lot guys for watching, bye.